Your customer sits down at the end of the day to watch a movie. They have a custom button that will perfectly set the lights, lower the shades, and start playing the movie. Which button will they prefer to see? This one or this one? Personalizing the image for custom buttons can make them look great and help your customers more easily understand their function. After completing this smart skill, you will be able to customize the icon for the Scenario Experience button. The Scenario Experience button can be used for initiating programming and allows you to customize the button's icon. This process requires four steps. First, download and prepare the driver file. Second, edit the driver's XML file. Third, replace the driver's default images. Fourth, add the driver to the project. Step 1. In System Design, click on the Search tab and type Scenario Experience button. Right-click on the driver and select Download Driver. After downloading the driver, make sure the Local checkbox is selected, then right-click on the local version of the driver and select Open Drivers Folder. In the window that opens, Find and make a copy of the Experience Scenario Button driver to your desktop. Change the file extension on the copy to .zip. If the operating system gives you a warning about changing the file extension, proceed with the change anyway. Step 2. Right-click on the file and select Extract All to unzip the file. Open the unzipped file and open the driver.xml file in a text or XML editor. In this example, you are making a custom button to activate a movie night scene, so rename the driver Movie Night. Do not use any spaces in the name. Enter your name as the creator, then enter the current date for the created and modified date. In the file path for each of the icons, replace the text experience-button-scenario within the file path with the new driver name, movie-night. There are 15 places where you need to make this change. Save and close the file. Step 3. In the Extracted Driver folder, open the www folder then open the Icons folder, and finally the Device folder. The Device folder contains the images for the Scenario Experience button icons. The driver uses two icons, one for an unselected state and one for when the button has been selected. Replace each of these files with the images that your customer wants. Use the exact name of the files you are replacing. Ensure that the images are PNG file format and have a transparent background. For file names that end in 70, the replacement images need to be 70 pixels by 70 pixels to display correctly. For those ending in 90, the images need to be 90 pixels by 90 pixels, and so on. Step 4. Navigate back to the Unzipped Driver folder and select all the files and folders within. Right-click and select Send, then Compressed Zipped Folder. Rename the zipped folder Movie Night. Change the file extension to .c4z. Copy the driver back into the Control 4 Drivers folder. Return to Composer and click File, Refresh. Select the living room in the project tree. Make sure that the local box is checked in the Search tab, then search for the driver you created. Double-click to add it to the project. Rename the driver Movie Night. Click on the living room. Click on the Navigator tab in Properties. Click on the Watch menu, then click the Modify button. Find and click on the Movie Night driver in the list of hidden drivers, 
Then click on the Show button. Click OK. Click File, then Refresh Navigators. The new image makes the custom button's purpose clear and really makes the icon pop.